Alright, what's up guys? Kaiju54 here, and I got this at uh, my fabulous finds down the street. $60. The person informed me that it was missing a few pieces, so let's get her open up. You might not see her for a second. I'm sorry. Oh my goodness. Get out of here, Jacob. Don't forget to check out my channel. Okay. Tomboy0999. Have a great day. Uh, I just wanted to see what this monster looks like. Bye. So I'm going to attempt to open it from the back and push it out a little bit. Yeah, that's a bad idea. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Push it out a little bit. Now, let's pull... Sure you'll be skipping this part so never... oh, I'll go get my sister real quick. It is missing a few pieces. It is a little messy. But I probably should open it. Crap. Look, there's that little piece right there. Don't know exactly what it is, but it's pretty from far away. You know what I'm talking about. We think so. Hey, what, what I'm really wondering about is... Uh, it's probably a little too... Okay, well, let's check. Look. Doesn't have it. Let's check. Seems like it'll hold up. The mothra, at least. Uh, let's stick... Uh, there's that for the head. Okay, now for the wings. Nice, thanks. Okay, so let's pull the wings out. As you can probably tell, the wings are exquisitely detailed, actually. So let's pop this wing right in. Seems as if the wing is a little bit floppy right now. So. What if it's on the wrong? It's not. On, it's on the wrong right side. How do you can tell? What's the stick for? Well, next one. Let's stick with this. Okay, I'm gonna have to probably end up gluing that in. I got a present for you. No. No. But there we go. There it is. So let's set that down. And deal with this one. Which. Let's just Jack, I'm going to keep the kids proudly. Nice. Come on. There it is. Come on. Okay. Right, this, this. So it's got. Uh, um. 
well, no, it doesn't fit. You can probably see right here, but it would hold the moth up like this. Okay. But there is one problem. If it's too heavy, then. Is bending. it too heavy? You gotta check, but I'm gonna lift it up and see if he's Look heavy. Look at the wings, Mom. Is he heavy? Yeah. Feel how heavy he is. But be careful with it. Yeah, it's probably too heavy for that. Yeah, probably. Well, yeah, that's probably the problem with it. Do you have a tooth? Okay, let's look. Okay. Check the feet. Alright, I'm gonna take I think a... I'll take the wings off for a little bit. I'm gonna, uh... Okay. Take the kid. You can organize and set it up and stuff, okay? Yeah. Well, yeah, yeah. since the legs can move a little bit, the mouth can definitely move. Give it that. Okay, so it's completely movie accurate. I can say that for sure. Such a beauty, such a beauty. Okay, so let's bring all that off. I'm gonna wanna glue these wings in so it stays put. Yeah, it's got all that, so good. Then the base, which is definitely pretty heavy. Alrighty. I'll end up reviewing this sometime, but this was just going to be a nice unboxing video for once. And if you want to know what it is, it's the X Plus 12 inch 1964 limited edition Mo Mothra. So yeah. And I got it for, s it's usually about uh, $400, $495 is what I found it for on Amazon. But, I found it at my fabulous find store for 60 For that price, I was expecting things like that to be wrong with it. But don't worry, I can probably add some extra plaster and plastic to it somehow. So yeah, makes sense. Oh, what's... I'll, I guess I'll start by pulling out some styrofoam off of it. Okay, wait, there's that. Now let's pull this piece out. Okay, well, I'm sorry. I'm not showing you, but I am going to try to clean it out with the worst way possible. Oh, oh I can never use the messy knife because it was before my own hand. Yeah, it's kind of sad. This will work. Hey, it worked. Okay, well, that's there. And there's that. Well, it's all unboxed, so. Yeah. There we go. I think I'll show it pleated in my review for it. And the working part on it is done. So I'll probably leave the legs how they are in this part. I'll only review the parts that are completely fixed. I mean, I do have some complete feet, so I'll review those, okay? So yeah, let's see if that goes. You got this huge wing, which by the way is that big compared to my hand. So. I'll have to stick these on, probably end up taking them off. Use some super glue or something. Yeah. So there. I guess I'll be looking for coat hangers for a little while now. Or maybe I could check. That's definitely not holding. Ugh. And I had some holding on here. Oh, yeah, that's not holding. There we go. Well, it's all of that, I guess. And considering the price that I got it for. Oh, okay, well. Yeah, 
this is more of a birthday thing, I believe. So, yeah. So I'm not going to really brag about it. It's really cool. I mean, I paid for it with my own money, so. Yeah, that, so it's more of a thing that I was planning to get on my birthday because my dad wouldn't be home. And he doesn't want me to get this kind of stuff because it's so big. And so, I've got some stuff that I'm going to get rid of in there. That should seal the deal. Especially since this guy is so big and it's got such good, great detail and it's worth so little. And I got so it for such a small amount of money. So yeah. And by the way, if you're wondering what I'm eating, it's a chocolate bar. Because I'm tired of this. Okay, so this will be the first video that I've uploaded for about a week. <laughs> about a week. First, I'll have to look for a way to get some nice stuff on it. I mean, it seems that the some of these legs are, like, really good right now, if you can t tell that. Okay. So, yeah, actually, I think I'll go over it right now. Okay. So, here, actually, I think I'll unplug Right now, I think I'll take it up here. Alrighty. Alrighty. Take that. I believe I'll start with the Mothra. Here's how it looks. And I'll also take this and set it right here. Because I need it there. And because it looks best there and all that. Okay. Oh, it's so hard to get this stuff done, especially with this pace. Alrighty. So, for her detail, it's really good. It's actually movie accurate. And it looks so cute and undevastatingly horrifying. I love it. And it's a kaiju. It's supposed to be horrifying. Oh, what were you thinking? Okay. So... Yeah, it's got extremely good detail. Let's zoom in on this a little bit. As you can see, this is like super close up. And you can still see details. Let's go as close as possible on this. And I don't even know where I'm at right now. Okay, here's the body. And let's see if I can get an eyeball right here. Okay, I have no idea what I'm doing. So how about this okay yeah a little bit less. so for the articulation I can turn its head like that but I don't really like moving it very much for what I got its ankles and stuff could move a little bit though I don't think they're supposed to so I'm not gonna move them I know one thing that's supposed to move though the mouth so if you can see the mouth opens and closes but I'm probably gonna keep it open because it opens a lot easier than it closes and well yeah so let's get that open okay so there it's got this nice contrast in colors right here it's got the yellow right here more yellow up here and then some white and it's got that basic mothra tone right here for the wings which i think are beautiful and huge like literally this is mothra by herself and this is part of the wing huh yeah that makes sense okay yeah i can believe for flying with that so it's got this nice wing shape, all that. It's beautiful, I believe. And it's even got this nice fur texture. It's got that 
eye looking part right here. Nice yellow, nice blackish color coming down here. More of a yellow color go going down here, and then some more red, orange, black, and more red right here. White, and then this gray color. Then you've got all that nice fur detail. Same thing on the back. Except it has this nice... Taking a bit. Nice curve right here. And it's got some paint chipping, as I said, so... Mostly because of... Because the person that sold it to me, he said he got it for about... I don't remember, around 30 bucks. So, here you go. Here's the other one. Now when we stick it on, I don't know if it wants to stay on right now or anything. Because it didn't seem to want to stay on a little bit ago. Huh, seems to want to stay on right here. For this one. I don't know about this one. Yeah, it seems like it went all the way on. It doesn't want to stay on ever. So, here it is. Like this. Okay, let's just hope that I can stay up. Okay, I'm gonna move this thing out a little bit. Hope support its weight. Okay, so here's what it looks like. That nice color right all over the place. It's got all this and it's got overall nice color texture. As you can see under here it's pretty nice. Under here also. Just all this nice color detail and all that. I love it. So as you can see he's pretty good. Now let's take the wings off to lower the weight. Okay, I'm gonna take this one off real quick. Then this one. I'm gonna have to thicken the second wing that I stuck on because that second wing does not want to stay on by itself. Okay, then let's take that head off. Okay, so the body does include some assembly. Mostly just the head and the wings. So you already saw the wings, I hope. But the head goes in, you just take that, you find this little hole right here in the middle, and then you find, and then you know where this is. Then you just find a nice spot to stick it in at. Then you just pop it right in there. Ugh, kind of fart. Okay, yeah. So there you go, and then when removing it, just twist it nice and slowly, and then it'll pop out. Alrighty, so there you go. Now for the stand. And I'm not going to talk about the wire right now. I'm going to probably use a wire. One second, I'm going to stick this away first. Looking kind of like that. Okay, okay. Now for the stand that you were probably hoping for. And the best way to tell the difference between the smaller one and the bigger one. This is the stand for the bigger one. Arrow, take it up. I'll put this up and show you guys. But that's the stand for the bigger one. You got a smaller egg than the body. Here's the egg compared to the body. Just a sec. For this, that's the egg compared to the body. Okay. You don't 
it's not a humongous egg. You definitely don't get a box that big. Like, seriously. That's my leg, and that's the box. Okay. But here's the most noticeable difference. It's the stand itself. It's got this maze look. It's not the island where the... It's not that seashore area where, by the sand where that's showing all this. It's on... Bur I believe Birth Island, I believe. I don't remember, but I don't have to check on, in on that. But, yeah, it's... Plus, the egg is right here in the middle. It goes in a specific way. No, there's a good thing that there's paid shipping right there. I know exactly how it goes on. Alrighty. But there's where the hole goes. The moth with the holes on the bottom. Pretty simple. There's a staircase right here. There's some kind of a staircase look. You got this little area up here, and that's about it. Pretty much how it goes. It's got a lot of details and stuff. It's I pretty much just think of it as stand. Thanks for this un for watching this unboxing video. If you did, then leave a thumb. If you liked it, leave a thumbs up and subscribe, and turn on notifications. Okay, so that you never miss another video. Okay, so. Here's the thing, I will upload videos whenever I want, like, no, literally, whenever I want. Just last week, I was doing it almost daily. This week, I I did it once a week, just once this week. Feeling kind of proud of myself here. But yeah, that's pretty much how I'm going to be doing it. Once a week, pretty much. Okay, so if you're wondering how this goes on... Pretty simple. Just plop that in there. Kind of like that. Except don't plop it in there. It's not cool. That. So, yeah. There's how it goes. And then again. Like, subscribe, turn on notifications. And view this as much as possible. I'm trying to get money. I'm just kidding. And... Peace out.